Peter Eisenman, a pioneer of deconstructivist architecture. Peter Eisenman is an American architect who is considered one of the pioneers of deconstructivism. Deconstructivism is an architectural movement that emerged in the early 1980s and is characterized by its use of fragmented forms, asymmetrical compositions, and non-Euclidean geometries. It is often seen as a reaction to the more rational and functionalist approaches of modernism. Eisenman's work is often cited as an example of deconstructivist architecture. His buildings are often seen as challenging the traditional notions of space, form, and function. For example, his House Vi, 1975-1995, is a private residence that is composed of a series of interlocking geometric volumes that are arranged in a non-Euclidean fashion. The Wexner Center for the Arts, 1989, is a museum and performing arts center that is characterized by its sharp angles and fragmented forms. Eisenman's work has been praised for its originality and its challenging of traditional architectural conventions. However, it has also been criticized for being too theoretical and for disregarding the practical needs of its users. Nevertheless, Eisenman is considered one of the most important architects of the 20th and 21st centuries, and his work continues to influence architects around the world. In addition to deconstructivism, Eisenman's work has also been associated with other architectural movements, such as postmodernism, structuralism, and post-structuralism. He has been influenced by a wide range of sources, including philosophy, linguistics, and mathematics. His work is often seen as a dialogue between these different disciplines. Eisenman is a prolific writer and theorist. He has published numerous books and articles on architecture. He is also a professor at the Yale School of Architecture. Eisenman's work continues to be debated and discussed. It is sure to continue to influence architects for many years to come. Here are some of the key features of Eisenman's architectural style. 1. Fragmented forms. Eisenman's buildings are often composed of fragmented forms that are arranged in a non-Euclidean fashion. This creates a sense of instability and disorientation. 2. Asymmetrical compositions. Eisenman's buildings often have asymmetrical compositions that disrupt the traditional sense of balance and order. 3. Non-Euclidean geometries. Eisenman's buildings often use non-Euclidean geometries, such as fractals and hypercubes. This creates a sense of complexity and ambiguity. 4. Theoretical approach. Eisenman's work is often based on theoretical concepts, such as the deconstruction of language and meaning. This can make his buildings difficult to understand and appreciate. Despite these challenges, Eisenman's work is highly influential and continues to inspire architects around the world. He is a true pioneer of deconstructivist architecture and his work has helped to shape the way we think about architecture today.